to the varsity to eat lunch. Going to the world of Coca Cola. It's right up there. So, let's get going. There's a lot of people here today. I guess it's summertime and it's at yeah, it's a line. I don't know if this is for tickets or for a good entrance. We're here now. Uh, they skipped the movie this time. They usually they have a movie that, a 10-minute movie that they play. Skipped it, but we're gonna go in the vault real quick see the uh, the Coke formula. at the vault. I get the secret formula. I want your secret. Give it to me. Let's go. I wish they had Dr. Pepper here. It's very crowded here. Never, I, I've never been here and it's been this crowded.
It has a bad aftertaste. Yeah. A lot of summer camp people here. Can't believe they brought them here. Can't believe they didn't break the safe. sensitive aromas just by smells. Please take this skill into the tasting room where I do recommend for you to smell everything before you taste it. All right, guys? You see the podiums in front of you? This is how you operate them. Pete signs up for me, friends. Pete signs up for me, please. On your white air canister, all you do is pump with your peace sign. Don't block the middle. That is where the aroma will come from. If you know that answer, friends, yell them out. For those who get the most right, I will shout out during this game. We will be playing sex. C1, C1. Give it a couple bumps. Let me know what you think for. C1 and yell your answers out. What you got, friends? Yell it out. So, pause everyone, pause. So for all of those who just said a drink name, I do not want the drink name, I want what makes the drink, which is the ingredients. 
We're not doing any drinks. If you think it smells like a drink, I need the ingredients. Four. 
Alright, push up, grab the one in the front, brother. Hold, everybody. Yeah, we're gonna play a game. They have these all these synths right here. We're gonna pick this one, figure out what it is. Alright, guys, everybody locked in? We are locked in. How are you guys doing? My name is Alex. I will be your game show host. I want to teach you to identify flavors and ingredients just by smells. It is a real skill, friends, that most people comp to wine tasting. I will let you know that did not exist before Coca-Cola, and Coca-Cola created that idea. So friends, I want to teach you that particular skill to take into the tasting room where I recommend for you to smell everything before you taste it. There's only one reason why, two countries, thought it was a beautiful idea to make a drink from barbecue sauce. Ooh, see some of those faces. <laughs> As I love to say, friends, I'm an American. It was not America. We created barbecue sauce, friends, so we know what to do with it. For those countries who decided not to cook with it, friends, and to drink it. Still blows my mind. You're gonna have China, for me, if you know their culture, friends, because I do love their culture, they use almost everything for food and beverages. One that does break my heart because I also do love their culture too, and it will be Italy and the Italian culture. You can name any dish from the Italian culture, friends, and then it will have nothing to do with barbecue sauce. So drinking it was also their best idea. So friends, and not the Italians here in America, brother, they know the difference. <laughs> so guys, Please smell everything before you taste it. This is my one recommendation for you. It will help you out today. If not, your nose has never lied to you before. If it does not taste pleasing or smell pleasing, it will not taste pleasing, okay, friends? So, you see the podiums in front of you? This is how you operate them. Peace signs up for me, friends. Peace signs up for me, please. On your white air canister, all you do is pump, just like so. Do pump and sniff. Don't block the middle. That is where the aroma will come from. If you know the answer, yell the answer out, okay? For those who get the most right, I will shout out. We're going to be playing set A1. A1. Give it a couple pumps. Let me know what you think for A1. What you think? I don't know. That's a weird one. First answer is supposed to be the easiest answer. It looks like we need a lot of help. I'm going to show you the first answer. You can, of course, smell it again. It will come right to your senses. So, Sam Bubbles, what do we have for this particular round? I'm smell it again, guys. No. I don't smell like that. All right, so, friends, this is the dilemma most people have. Most people have only ever experienced smelling roasted marshmallows. So, if you were to pick a flavor for a marshmallow, what would it be? Where is she? What would it be? Vanilla would be the, is the correct answer. Yes, yes, yes. We only got two people to learn. Some people use it for soup, but it is used for a pie too, okay, friends? So, that's what that looks like here at Coca-Cola. If you combine all of these items to make a season of the year, what season would you have, friends? Christmas. Fall. No, fall. Christmas. All right, so I just going to say, you can roll with Christmas, okay? You can, because the only up there that said, only item up there that said fall was cinnamon. Only item. You can say ginger, but you don't use major ginger other than a gingerbread house that's the only thing you use in fall but majority of those items are winter items that's what that looks like here coca-cola friends before you guys go remember smell everything before you taste it look out for my favorite drink fanta apple kiwi from thailand and guys i'll smell you later have a great day taste everything we want to find a barbecue soda We're going to taste everything. Have fun with us.
This is Tab from 1980s. Do you want to say closer to the Fanta? Mm. Oh god, yeah. It's like medicine. like barbecue sauce. This is the one he was talking about. Want to taste? Original taste. So we went to the world of Coca-Cola and it's a different experience especially from the last time I came here. A lot more interactive. Uh, which is nice. Um, a couple of new things that I, I saw. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen them before. And uh, the last part, come and try all the Coke products from all over the world. And so, uh, some of them is kind of nasty. Some of them is okay. Um, stay away from the stuff that uh, from China. It's, it tastes like uh, what's it called? Uh, barbecue sauce. No, not a good. It says sour plum. That is not sour plum. That's different experience than last time, so come, come check it out. So the next place we're going is the Varsity to go get a burger or something. Here at the Varsity, gonna eat some burgers. I got a chili burger. We got a kid's hamburger. My first time at the Varsity. Her first time at the Varsity. I don't know. It's okay. Need experience. And I have summer camp kids coming here. Filled up the place. So people better find a seat before they sit down. <laughs> <laughs> 